Hey, what's up, Hunters? 12 here, and welcome back once again to Assassin's Creed. Um, as you guys can tell, we, well, we're sort of, well, actually, we're on the right track to um, getting the treasure. Uh, apparently, um, the two scientists, well, the other guy is sort of on his hyper side, or his, um, his work side basically he just wants us to jump into the anatomist and get going. Oh, and apparently, around. No, wait, let me pause. Apparently, um, the assassins, the um, the mod, the modern, the um, blah, the modern assassins are trying to save us, which um, scientists told us. So yeah, let's just um, jump right into this. And lie down on the animus. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> Time to start the program, Desmond. Okay, apparently we got two targets on this one. And here's the treasure. Okay. Climb tall structures to gain a bird's eye view of your surroundings. Come in, Altair. I trust you are well rested? Ready for your remaining trials? I am, but I'd speak with you first. I have questions. Ask them. I'll do my best to answer. The merchant king of Damas murdered the nobles who ruled his city. Mejdeddin in Jerusalem used fear to force his people into submission. I suspect William meant to murder Richard and hold Akka with his troops. These men were meant to aid their leaders. Instead, they chose to betray them. What I do not understand is why. Is the answer not obvious? The Templars desire control. Each man, as you've noted, wanted to claim their cities in the Templar name, that the Templars themselves might rule the Holy Land and eventually beyond. But they cannot succeed in their mission. Why is that? Their plans depend upon the Templar treasure, the Peace of Eden. But we hold it now, and they cannot hope to achieve their goals without it. What is this treasure? It is temptation. It's just a piece of silver. Look at it. What am I supposed to see? This piece of silver cast out Adam and Eve. It turns staves into snakes parted and closed the Red Sea. Eris used it to start the Trojan War, and with it a poor carpenter turned water into wine. It seems rather plain for all the power you claim it has. How does it work? He who holds it commands the hearts and minds of whoever looks upon it. Whoever tastes of it, as they say. Then Gagne's men? An experiment. Herbs used to simulate its effects, to be ready for when they held it. Talel supplied them. Tamir equipped them. They were preparing for something. But what? War. And the others, the men who ruled the cities, they meant to gather up their people, make them like Gagne's men. The perfect citizens, the perfect soldiers, a perfect world. Robert de Sable must never have this back. So long as he and his brothers live, they will try that they must be destroyed. Which is what I've had you doing. There are two more Templars who require your attention. One in Akka, known as Sibral. One in Damas, called Jubair. Visit with the Bureau leaders. They'll instruct you further. As you wish. Be quick about it. No doubt Robert de Sable is made nervous by our continued success. His remaining followers will do their best to expose you. They know you come, the man in the White Hood. They'll be looking for you. They won't find me. I'm but a blade in the crowd. Here, my gift to you, in gratitude for the good work you've done. We got a new blade. Sharp. Deadly. 
and it's ours. Alright, let's um head down to for our next for our assassination. Or head down to the bureau. All right, again, let's go down the um the list. Jar carriers can easily break your cover if you cause them to drop what they're carrying. Damas. Come in, stay a while. Tell me all about your adventures. I'm afraid I don't have the time. I see. Too important for me now. It's not that. No, no, of course not. How may I serve you then? Al Muallam has asked I take the life of the one they call Jubair. Ah, Salah Adin's chief scholar. Strange choice of target, in my opinion. But who are we to question the master's will? I'm sure he has his reasons. Then you're familiar with the man. He's been quite busy these past few days, organizing the scholars and sending them into the streets to preach. What do they speak of? Light and fire, cleansing sins, apocalyptic nonsense, if you ask me. <laughs> All this talk of paths and a new world. What about this new world? Couldn't say, I don't pay attention to the ramblings of madmen. Much too busy with real world. Very well. I'll walk among the people, see what I can learn. Where would you suggest I search? South of here, you'll find an academy and a guard tower. They're both good places to search. There's also a hospital to the east you might want to visit. I'll begin at once. So eager. You've certainly changed. And for the better, I might add. Alright, southwest and to the east. Now, I'm assuming that we need four. Or it might be still, might be three. So let's head down to the east. You dare steal in my presence? That will cost you your life! He said that there's a, ho a hospital towards the east. Oh crap. This is our chance to begin a new no interrogation. Let Zubair lead you to revelation. Let him lead you to the light. Zubair sees things the way they truly are. Sees the poison you carry in your hearts and minds. He works to cast it out. Remove all texts from your homes and schools. Give them to us. They must be destroyed. Take yourself from my sight. Answer, my child. In this we agree. So speak and I may stay my blade. What is it your master intends? Why destroy all this knowledge? We lay the stones to build a road upon which soon all men will travel. It leads to a better tomorrow. 
That is not what I see. No, you are blind. The words upon these parchments, they are poison. Jubayer holds the cure. He'll free us from their lies. It's nonsense you speak. You've lost your mind. No, not lost, but found. I see the world for what it truly is. He has shown me so much. I am illuminated. A fanatic is all you are, and dangerous for it. Do what you must, it changes nothing. We are not afraid. You should be. Adair, my friend, you have become quite the wanted man, as am I. I must prepare my family for the trip back to the safety of Masayef this afternoon. Could you finish my last assignment in exchange for information? Some men must be eliminated in Jubair's quarter. Be fast, my friend. I counted for assassination. Be wary, friend. The Shaitan is everywhere, watching, waiting. He tempts us always. Be strong, strong like Salahadin, and take up arms against our enemies in whatever way you can. I stand before you to deliver a warning. Richard, take Joppa. He's gone. There Face.
this guy. any trouble. A few 
few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. I need food. I'm so hungry. Just a little Just money, a I beg of you. Please. No, please don't leave. Just a few coins, please. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. Get away from me. All I ask is for a few coins. Please, sir, have any money? I have no head here! Infidels die! Infidels! No further. This guy just turned around on me. Come no further. This person. Get it rejected. Be here. Be gone. Uh. Alright, I gotta keep on trying it until I get it right. <clears throat> Fuck it. <laughs> 
Um, I'm going to see if I can get that last guy first. so quickly and in one piece. I must return to my family, but before I leave, this is for you. I found a map showing where scholars are planning to burn books and other sources of knowledge. Please be careful and let the future reunite us. I'll give your blessings to my family. Nice. Are you a friend of mine? Um, let's see if we can go a bit more higher up. Let's check around here. Check a bit more to the east. Give me a second, I just got extremely itchy right now. Thank you. 
Check a bit more to the left. Let's check out this viewpoint. Everything's new. Have a look. Everything you want in my pocket. That will cost you your life. I think we need one more, or maybe two more. Not too sure exact. I'll have your hand for that. Check further this way. There could be one around here, maybe. something. found a letter on him which I gave to Namayir, who said he'd find you and deliver it. But from the look in your face, I suspect this hasn't happened. Go on then. Don't waste any more time with me. Seek Namayir and get that letter. Huh. And the Hosanna! What have I done? Huh? 
Pretty close. My family. Where is he going? He's going to hurt someone. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> Why would he do that? You shouldn't be here. Be gone. Everywhere they ride, they leave only suffering in their wake. Okay. He's going to hurt himself. He can't do it after when he does. I won't help him. Turn back now. You gotta be shitting me. Okay, there you go. Out here, here. Take this. I've been looking everywhere for you. Now I can finally return to Masiaf. Last time I offered to do someone a favor. Okay. So I guess we just only needed three. I think the last one should be four. Yeah, the last one should be four. Not, not this part, but the other one, basically, the next um chapter. What you know then? Jubayer has become obsessed with purging the city of its knowledge. The most terrible crime. Now I see why Al Mualim wants you to remove him. He's using the city scholars to assist him. They go out into the streets, harassing the people and collecting all their written works. I fear he intends to destroy them all. He must be stopped. That's why I'm here. He's to hold a meeting soon at the Madrasa Al Qalasa. It's where I'll go. It's where I'll take his life. I'll leave you alone to prepare. 
bring glory to the Brotherhood. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Someone's destroying knowledge. Or burning books. Let's go stop them. Alright, let's go assassinate. Let's go assassinate some targets. Come oh, on, this guy doesn't seem like he's far away. You are not supposed to be here, me. Single text in this city must be destroyed. My friend, you must not do this. Much knowledge rests within these parchments, put there by our ancestors for good reason. And what reason is this? They are beacons meant to guide us, to save us from the darkness that is ignorance. No, these bits of paper are covered in lies. They poison your minds, and so long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. How can you accuse these scrolls of being weapons? They are tools of learning. You turn to them for answers and salvation. You rely more upon them than yourselves. This makes you weak and stupid. You trust in words, drops of ink. Do you ever stop to think of who put them there? Or why? No. You simply accept their words without question. And what if those words speak falsely, as they often do? This is dangerous. You are wrong. These texts give the gift of knowledge. We need them. You love your precious writings. You do anything for them? Yes. Uh, yes, of course. Then join them! <laughs> Any man who speaks as he is just as much a threat. Do any else among you wish to challenge me? Good. Your orders are simple enough. Go out into the city. Collect any remaining writings and add them to the piles in the streets. When you're done, we'll send a cart to collect them, that they may be destroyed. Holy crap, we got multiple targets. So, you must not trespass here. Good people of the mass, you are 
doing the right thing. Let us cleanse this city of its poisoned past. This is a righteous act, and from the flames shall be born a new era, one of truth and unity, governed by a singular wisdom. God damn it. Good people of Damas, you, you are doing the right thing. Let us cleanse this city of its poisoned past. This is a righteous act, and from the flames shall be born a new era, one of truth and unity. Far from me. What? He's not dead. one of them. Whoa, that's a lot of guys. Well, let's fight them. basically okay let's go assassinate these guys Doing the right thing. 
Let us cleanse this city of its poisoned past. This is a righteous no act. And from the flames die. shall be born a new era, one of truth and unity, governed by a singular wisdom. Damn it. Kill these guys, his little minions. Why? Why have you done this? Men must be free to do what they believe. It is not our right to punish one for thinking what they do, no matter how much we disagree. Then what? You of all people should know the answer. Educate them. Teach them right from wrong. It must be knowledge that frees them, not force. They do not learn. Fixed in their ways as they are. You are naive to think otherwise. It's an illness. For which there is but one cure. You're wrong. And that's why you must be put to rest. Am I not unlike those precious books you seek to save? A source of knowledge with which you disagree. Yet you are rather quick to steal my life. A small sacrifice to save many. It is necessary. Is it not ancient scrolls that inspire the Crusaders? That fill Salah ad and his men with a sense of righteous fury? Their texts endanger others, bring death in their wake. I too was making a small sacrifice. It matters little now. Your deed is done. And so am I. Altair, tell me you've met with success. Yes. Jubayer's fires are extinguished. His life as well. Excellent news. I had no doubt you'd succeed. You should have seen it. The scholars followed him so readily. It wasn't just books they fed to fire either, but any man who opposed them. Such ignorance breeds only evil. You've done a good thing this day. As with my other targets, he believed he was doing the right thing, clearing a path to a better future. Of course he would. Such is the landscape of a madman's mind. The things I've seen these past few weeks, it's as if all the land has gone mad. And this is why we fight to end the war. That sanity might return. The people are desperate for direction. It's easy for men like Jubayer to prey on this and turn them towards evil. You should go, Altair. Return to Al-Mualim. Tell him what you saw. Let him know the good you've done this day. 
Safety and peace, Rafi. Upon you as well. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. All right. That sort of came out terrible, but we actually did. Well, actually, I kind of managed, you know, trying to clean myself up a bit. It's pretty. It's pretty funny. So let's go back to our master. Countering a strong attack will leave your enemy vulnerable. Finish him by bringing. Welcome home, child. What news? Another of the named is put to rest. Then it would appear your work is nearly complete, and your status restored. A question, Master, if I may. Ask, and I will answer. Why these men, Jubayer and Sabrand? Ah, don't you see? They paved the way for change. Ensure threats both old and new are not given cause to intervene. To weaken them is to weaken our enemy. I suppose that makes sense. Were these men to continue their work, our work would quickly be undone. How is that? We've caused them much grief. We strike at the arms, yes, but this is a hydra that you face, and it is quick to replace that which is severed. Then we should lop off its head and be done with this. Soon, soon. We are close. Only one more man stands between us and our ultimate goal. I will return to my work. The sooner this last man dies, the sooner I might face our true enemy. Before you go, I have a question for you. Of course. What is the truth? We place faith in ourselves. We see the world the way it really is, and hope that one day all mankind might see the same. What is the world, then? An illusion. One which we can either submit to, as most do, or transcend. What is it to transcend? To recognize nothing is true and everything is permitted. That laws arise not from divinity but reason. I understand now that our creed does not command us to be free. It commands us to be wise. Do you see now why the Templars are a threat? Whereas we would dispel the illusion, they would use it to rule. Yes, to reshape the world in an image more pleasing to them. That is why I sent you to steal their treasure. That is why I keep it locked away. And that is why you kill them. So long as even one survives, so too does their desire to create a new world order. Take your equipment. Seek out this last man. With his death, Robert de Sable will at last be vulnerable. It will be done. Safety and peace upon you, Altair. Well, apparently, I guess, someone survived, if you kind of think about it. The, um... When we leave it the anatomist, apparently there's still more Templars. Templars are still alive. Yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this. And yes, I know, I fucked up, I failed. E12, what the fuck you doing? Three times in a row, restarted one single little memory, and then screwed up. I know. I know. But, it's a part of my videos. I screw up, I fix it right in the right in the middle of the video but until then my name my name's e12 e12 the screw up e12 from twitch e12 from the sky e12 from the light and hopefully you guys will enjoy this motherfucking video well you guys already did but <laughs> so until then my name's e12 e12 sky whatever floats your boy and hopefully you guys enjoy this bit peace out and as always take the time out of your day to enjoy and i know i repeated myself it's part of the flow Take it easy, guys and ladies. Peace out. Damn, I'm all over today. <laughs>